Secondo le statistiche di YouTube, solo l'1% di chi guarda i miei video è iscritto al canale. Mi aiuteresti molto se decidessi di iscriverti ora. Grazie! Oh shit, open mic gamer. Maggie so underrated this meta too. Dude, Maggie would probably be super fun. The only reason I, I can't play Maggie right now because I haven't played Apex in a long time. And so what happens is... Bro, do I mute these guys? What the fuck is this? Oh my god, he's actually console cross playing Pog. Dude, he's, he's eating into his microphone. Holy shit. Yo, what are you eating? Doritos. Doritos? That's a fucking gamer. Holy shit, literally eating Doritos. What? Wait, what? Got my Doritos, got my G Fuel, I'm ready to game. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, dude. A split one with oxygen he was insane and then he goes to land and get, get shit on and you got 38th oh yeah by chance. the way can i put a thing out there yep it was not my call to fucking rat tsn i, I do i <laughs> felt they horrible were so pissed bro on i felt that. so fucking bad i was like timmy this is fucked he's like he's like just land on me like we're gonna do this and i was like all right fine, no dude. one knows who anyone is in optic once again they can't manage it it's gonna be dojo versus tsn as the circle closes and t Yet more teams achieving match point eligibility with that win. TSM, of course, will throw themselves above that threshold. Like I said, the difference between our games and TSM's games is that they did well when they should have and we didn't do well when we should have. And I'll say it again, I think if TSM was to be put in our shoes in the same spots and like places and zones that we had from our POIs, like they probably would have still wanted to playing as well as they did. I feel like we were just, we were not going to call to be honest, like from playing from middle siphon, like one, that was our first time playing from middle siphon. And two, like we've always been told, you know, by Raven, like that building is just trash. It's clusterfuck. Yeah. It that is. building is just, building. Yeah. yeah middle it's a building, like, that, that building is just trash. It's awkward fight too. Yeah. yeah. Like you can't really stop people from getting, getting bottom floor. So it's True. just like, you know, we were stuck in a building we're not familiar with. We're stuck in a building that we can't, you know, stop people from getting in. And, you know, the zone is obviously not ending on top of us. But then Jordan, like, he made a call to rotate early or go to a spot underneath launch light. And that call basically just won us the game, practically. It's Optic and now it's just two! Optic Gaming might be about to break records! Two squads remaining, it's NRG versus Optic! Everyone in the arena has just become an NRG fan as they want this tournament to continue. Prowler for Nathan. Could that be the difference maker? Sweet has to retreat, does he have a shield swap? No he doesn't, Sweet goes down! Not gets the first kill for Optic! Dropped, tries to move in and clean up the pieces. Optic will fall! NRG clutch! And Optic Gaming, who are on the precipice of becoming your champions, will have to wait a little longer. NRG with the clutchest. I'm about to stick this guy. No cap. Oh, I stuck up. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> the zone cut in half. Pressure on Verhost as the catalyst to make a play. Starfight could play pie poopers here, and TSM are going to have to wait. These Watson fences could be massive. Apex folklore once again repeating itself as how. Once again from the heavens. Gets the opening knock! The CEO! With a hostile takeover! TSM! Are your champions! Come on. 
このメンバーにやりません。はい。これはもう確定なんで。別に。こんな。でも、契約的に PVX には、あの、もう、まだまだいますよ。その後どうなるかはわかりませんよ。ポーズ中のルールって最初から決まったの一応ね、喋っちゃダメみたいになったけどね。なんか、あの、まあ、だから結構喋ってです。All three games, we had the advantage on the contest. We landed ahead of them. Our strategy was better than them. And we got fucking guns every single game. We had the advantage every single game. We just threw it. So, I don't know if it was nerves or whatever the fuck it was, but we should have won every single game. Because we had a better game plan going into it. We just fucking couldn't execute it. And I don't know if that's just because of fucking finals nerves or whatever. But we had the advantage every game and we just threw the advantage. So I am not worried about the future because the contest is not something that we need to like. The contest isn't what we need to practice on. It's more about being locked in in the finals, I guess. Like, I don't know. I think that's the most thing we need to worry about. Just figuring out the fucking experience and nerves going into the finals so that we can actually play our game. We need Singularity to do good here, Greek. They need to do good themselves. We'll see what happens. Uh oh. Easy flash with the knock on the bin. Yeah, easy flash does go down. Are they pushing? Oh, easy they flash are. is getting aggressive. Oh my god, this man's all by his lonesome. There is no one here in all Greek. Oh okay, my god, gets a knock on to Elysium. But he gets one by the horizon and a 162 from Easy what Flash. Watch. What am this I watching? This kid is insane. What am I watching? Oh what am my I god, he gets a knock on the Arton. No, he does not. No, he, he does not. He watched him drop. He watched him drop. He did. Easy Flash Kid with the mechanics of the day god being displayed. Damn. What am I watching? Put some fucking respect on Easy Flash Kid's name, man. This kid is gross. He is disgusting. And there it is. He's gonna get this last kill too, I guarantee it, bro. He's feeling himself. Singularity here, white. Man. That's what I'm talking about, bro. Easy flash with another kill. Put some damn respect on this kid's uh, name. We are going to run it back. Woo! <laughs> we are going to continue playing together. Um, Woo! We are going to scrim. We're going to play the next tournament. I think the next LAN is in three or four months. So uh, we're just going to prepare for that. And we should, you know, hopefully qual for that one and do well as well and, and take it. The fucking trophy home so i'm excited i'm very excited for us uh i personally think that we are one of the top fighting teams out there as as proven we have like the most kills uh we take usually a lot of the fights yeah you know we 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 have strategies in terms of ratting but that's the game you know hate hate me for playing the fucking game in a different way than some other teams will but do what you gotta do to take just you know to win as of lately it's been tsm dark zero right how does it feel knowing that these guys got to play another eight games? They don't get, a, you know, you get more rest than them. Uh, and they have the potential to be kicked out of the tournament and sent home. You know, like, what do you think? I think it's pretty wild. It's pretty wild to see them down there. You know, I'm sure that's like, it's kind of how everyone's like, back when we had to make a loser's bracket run, I think everyone was a bit surprised. I'm personally a bit surprised. Uh, I think, I think they'll make it through. But you know, anything, anything can happen. And you know, a couple bad zones, a couple broken mentals, and you know, they could just fumble. Like, I, I mean, now, after, after having their placement now, like, you never know, like, it could be like a mental, like, snowball, and they just, like, keep performing worse and worse, you know? So, they could, I, I, I would not be surprised now to see them not make it. <laughs> when you're a master of black holes, relativity becomes, well, Relative. <laughs> that was so great. I felt like I was playing Apex. Listen, I really want you to know I speak for every single person here. I speak for every single person who plays Apex. We appreciate everything you have given Apex. Dreamfire is going to be a beast to fight against. You can see Yanya right there and Dreamfire with all of their space occupying that ultimate high ground. You put an L-Star in Sandwich's hands, you know what happens.
up here. Plenty of ammunition left, plenty of high ground. What they won't have as much of is cover during the next ring. Dojo go down, LG go down, Dreamfire are pushing for the win, but they haven't done enough, even a crack. Can they play this perfectly? TSM, TSM intense. They have put themselves into contention for advanced starting points, and Dreamfire full sending down. Him in the Roy back. Falls, three MC falls, and TSM, they are going to find themselves in the winner's bracket. Dreamfire have been on a rampage this tournament, but in the last game of the winner's bracket, TSM. You are in a relationship with the 1,000 ELO <laughs> chess player. Hey, good job, baby. I'm him! Good job. Where are you going? Where are you I'm him! You look big. Yeah, I'm massive! Hey. And in the brain, too. <laughs> well, I'm talking about. Oh, bro. I'm so good at this game. Damn it. I'm so good at this game. Oh, really? Where? Clear me, clear me, clear here, clear here, clear here. There you go. There you go. What the hell? Who the fuck? Ah, you no! No! You bastard! Yeah, I mean, I was. This is what I was like saying to. You. So I was like pretty fucking, I was pretty upset when we lost, right? Because like we did have opportunities, but when I found out, when I found out that TSM won the last three games in a row, you know, it's kind of like, I kind of just had to tip the hat. You know what I mean? Like, they really, you know, it's it's hard to be mad when they just won three games in a row, which I don't even think has ever, that's literally never been done in a finals lobby. Like, that's, that's fucking insane. Three wins in a row in a finals lobby. I was like, that, that kind of, I was like, okay, you know, they fucking, they popped off. How can you, how can you be as mad about that, right? Let's get this, uh, big fighting right here, you know? Yep, yep, I got, I got a zip right on top. Yeah, you do, you bad boy. Yeah. 